Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this episode of Logic. The false dichotomy fallacy is the topic of this video. Now, the false dichotomy fallacy is committed when two unlikely options are presented as if they're the only options available. The following illustration will provide an example. Are you going to invite me to your Super Bowl party? Well, uh, um... Okay, well, either you invite me or you're not really my friend. All right, let's take a closer look at what just happened. Well, Cindy's first premise is that either Frank invites her or he's not really her friend. Now, Cindy's second premise is implied. Her second premise is that Frank is really her friend. So her conclusion, which follows validly, is that Frank will invite her. But Cindy's argument is fallacious. She creates the illusion that her options are the only ones available, when in fact, they're probably not. You see, she creates the illusion that either or premise is true, when in fact, it's probably false. Now, the false dichotomy is easy to recognize because it always involves an either or premise, well, at least implicitly. But for the fallacy to be committed, the premise must be false or probably false. If you want to be an expert at recognizing defective reasoning with the ability to provide clear and concise answers, then see our other videos on logic. Comment, like, share, and subscribe, and have a great day.